Also, just a little update. I got everything going on the van now. Dash lights, got the fan. I put in a new fan motor. So we got AC, charged up the AC. I put in a toggle switch, chunk chunk, for the horn. Should pass specs, eh? Oh, if anyone has any cassette players, you know those little uh, tapes? I could use them in here. It's an old player. But any tapes, fairly rock and roll. Well, actually, anything country, anything's good. Yeah, so we got that all in. I put a new pull cable. The other one was sheared, I don't know if I remember, but it was sheared off. Pull cable, it wasn't the exact right length, but I just uh, adjusted it, put her in, and it's good. New battery, hooked all the wires together, fuses in place. I got a new uh, pump for the water, for the windshield wash. It was burnt right out, it's actually falling apart. But I managed to find another one on Amazon. Charge the AC. A horn, I just wired in a horn because the old ones are still in there, but I don't know which wire is not working or what working, so I just wired it to the toggle switch. And there's the new fan motor in there, working like a dream. So the next big step in my adventure or my dream, I'm going to start looking for land. So I'll take the dream machine, doing some longer trips, maybe back to Alberta, and look for some land. Because I still want to try doing the off-grid thing for a while. I'm not, I don't like to commit to things too, at too much uh, ahead of time, but I think I'm going to really like it. And if I do, well, that's great. But that'll be a lot of uh, a lot of hard work, but a lot of interesting stuff too. Also, constantly learning. But tonight I got to work a night shift, more security work. But it all adds to the coffers. More money. Get some land, get a little more freedom. Dream the dream. What else can a guy do, right? <laughs>